like a boss. All right, ladies, this is Alex from My Foot Attraction. And today we're going to be talking about um, the question is how to change a man who cheated, right? And I got this question asked by one of my clients, and she allowed me to post a live through giving her a discount which lets her ask the question at a lower price and lets me post a live, right? Obviously, there's some things that change so that her identity remain, remains um, anonymous, all right? But we're gonna be talking about this right now, all right? All right, so let's begin this, okay? All right, she goes with, um, he conf how to change a man who cheated? He confessed literally everything, showed all his vulnerabilities and weaknesses. He put down his ego and admitted to all his faults. He was shaking when he, he was shaking when he told me this, when he told me everything. Like, I believe it takes a lot of bravery to do that. And he truly felt guilty and, ug and, 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 and ugly at, at that moment. Yet it doesn't mean he won't do it again. There you go. There you go, girl. My theory is that he craves for emotional experience that I can't provide because I'm rational. I am rational and emotionless. The reason why... One, I like him. Two, fixing relationship and looking. Okay, the reason why you messaged me is one, I like him. Two, fixing relationship and looking for new relationship are the, are on that are on the same level of consumption level. Three, I want to stable. I want a stable facade to make my mom not worry about me. In order to genuinely change his behavior, he has to be emotionally stirred up. But I'm not sure the next step and how to make it this long term. <laughs> Jesus Christ, my love, my love, my love, my love. You're literally asking me how to how to how to, how to struggle with a God for the rest of your life. Please don't do this. Please don't do this. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. Ladies in the comment section, please be nice. All right, you all been there. Please be nice, but don't do this. Oh, come on, man. Come on, man. You can't be doing this. He cheated. He cheated. And for your mom, a statement for side for your mom, fuck your mom. No, oops, no, wait, 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 wait. I take it back, okay? I will never tell a person to, to fuck their moms, okay? Sorry about that. Your mom's a great person. She gave you birth. I'm sorry. But if she's pressuring you to have a relationship for her sake, then yeah. Yeah, she, you, go, you go tell her to fuck herself because you're not going to be with a person who cheated on you just to have a facade. It's better to be made fun of or, or, or thought of as the girl who can't find a husband than to be when in with a husband who you're completely unhappy with and being cheated on. Come on, man. Where are you from? I'm not going to say where you're from. Okay. 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 She's from Korea. Okay. She's from South Korea. All right. All right. Okay. I can see that. I'm sorry. I don't, I don't even mean to say that. I can see that. That's different. That's different. My God. I'm sorry. You tell your mom, look, mom. He cheated on me. I can't. You, you can't do this, man. You can't do this. You can't. You can't. I'm sorry. You can't. You can't. I can't give you advice for that because if I give you advice for this, he's just gonna he's gonna repeat the behavior. Come on, girl. Come on. Come home. Nah, not even come home. Like, like the problem is, is the pressure from your family. And you said you like him. I, you gotta find yourself a new man, yo. Look, man. Go watch my video called Value Self-Respect Over a Relationship. Yeah, that's literally the video. Value Self-Respect Over a Relationship. Go watch that video. And that video will tell you everything you need to do to make sure this doesn't happen to you. Because you can't be doing this, girl. You're literally asking for trouble. And you're literally making me more income. And I don't want more. I don't want your money at, your, at, 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 at the sake of your self-esteem. It's not worth it to me. That's not the point of this channel. You see what I'm saying? So, yeah, move on from this, man. It's just it's not worth it, man. Like... He truly felt good. Get the fuck out of here. And he was shaking. Get the fuck out of here, man. No, no, no. Fuck that shit, man. I can't believe that. I can't believe the shaking works. Um, move on, man, okay? It's fine. I'm sorry. Move on. I hate the fact that this is the advice that I give most of you ladies, but it's for a reason, man. Some of you guys are just hard-headed. You know? Stubborn. Don't forget to purchase my merch, man. People think they're slick, man. They think they're slick? Purchase my merch in the description down below. They think they're slick, man. Look, lady, you can have to join my book. Go watch my video on my book club on my other channel called um, the first chapter of Robert Greene's book um, um, book called um, the Law of Irrationality. Go watch that. It'll it'll really help. I'm not insulting you. Um, all right, I'm sorry about that, but yeah, it is what it is. All right, ladies, I um, hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's live stream. It was fun. 
some of you guys are out of control to be honest with you and don't forget to subscribe to you know follow me on instagram if you guys want to ask me those questions and um also i you know my my book club i also have a a top 10 books on my description so if you guys want to know the, the books that i recommend is in the description down below and um yeah man and I'll be, i'm going to be doing a few seminars in europe so also go to the description down below where i'm going to be doing the seminar in europe next year all right all right my love be safe i hope i was able to help you out i hope you're not crying um but it is what it is man you can't stay with home okay um now look if you want to make this work you have to how can i say this you just cannot tolerate the cheating part that's the problem it's that that is a no tolerance you know like it's one thing he flirted with somebody but the cheating part is no tolerance to avoid cheating you can't avoid it but this is what you could do just completely to avoid cheating or at least to minimize the effect you got to give a guy more space than necessary and i know it's easy and i know it's kind of intuitive but in reality if you give a guy enough space he's gonna notice how much how can i say he's gonna sense that that hit that that he's gonna say man like why doesn't she like me enough but and that's gonna make him close the gaps that you're not closing by you giving him space you know and that's what i teach in this channel but just go watch the video i recommend you it'll really help you on top of this video all right all right be safe all right ladies and gentlemen if you guys ever want to learn how to use your feminine energy to influence people learn how to use your masculine energy to become more assertive and also learn how to blend both energies to improve your dating life your spiritual life honestly um, your relationship life your family life your career life this is the course for you if i had to make a course for my nieces i have two nieces one is 8 19 and one is 14 15 16 holy shit oh my god he's a bad fucking uncle he's a, he's a bad uncle get him shut up melissa you should, you should get this course right and this is the course that i will make for them so for example watch the curriculum right in the first week we're going to be showing you how to establish a strong masculine foundation without letting it hurt your feminine energy this masculine foundation is a source of who you are right it's it's your bodyguard without this your whatever feminine energy you create will be destroyed by the outside because your your fem your masculine is your shield so we'll talk about goal setting we'll talk about how to develop a serious attitude we're going to be talking about how to um how to use more logic how to use more goal oriented behavior it's more how to be a man <laughs> you know it you know now the next one is how to embrace the feminine energy right this one would this one will teach you about how to minimize excessive masculine traits developing self-awareness healing abundant feminine energy, regulating your emotion, vo uh, mastering voice qualities and, ex and facial expressions, surrendering control and allowing pain to be felt. This is honestly, it's, it's, it, it, this will supercharge, like, like, like Kayo Ken, your masculine energy. After that, we have um, femininity in the workplace and how to be feminine in the workplace without letting people take advantage of you and the nuances of um, how women on power should behave versus women who are subordinates in the workplace. And even the dress code, they, they, these are, this is based on psychology, people. It's kind of insane. I'm actually excited about this one. The next week, we talk about navigating the labyrinth of male and female friendship. And this, a lot of women find confusing, so we talk about that. And how to identify envious friends, how to identify the good friends, how to keep male friends, and how to keep female friends. Week five, we talk about how to release the burden of the past and stop and destroy mental projections. This is actually really powerful. Um, and this, and then week six, we talk about how to increase your observational power so that you so that you can read people better. Um, and we have a bunch of bonuses. It, the course starts at um, nine at ninety nine dollars, um, and you guys can pre order the course today at sixty nine dollars before it goes out. Um, if you're watching this, most likely I'm in the meditation retreat, so I really, most likely I will be praying for all of you guys. And um, just click on the description down below of the video, right there. You'll see it, and you can pre order that course. It's gonna be out by by the end of next month or the beginning of February of, of March. One of the two people, because I have a 10-day retreat to do. And I want to I want to finish the course um, after the retreat, because I think the, the ideas are going to be so much better. All right, man, I'll see you guys later. Free order, man. Oh, I'm closing the channel.